Hello everyone, it's the Hobby Dabbler. Today I'm going to be trying to make my own alcohol inks using leftover um, inkjet printer ink. So I had an inkjet printer. The thing was always drying out on me. I bought bottles of the refill inks and then we went to a laser printer and now I have these bottles of inks left over. So what I want to do is I want to see if I can turn it into alcohol ink to use in my projects. So from what I understand you can make any color in the rainbow with these inks if you have cyan, magenta, yellow, and black. So CMYK. K is black. Cyan, magenta, yellow, black is K. So I went online and I looked for recipes kind of of how to make colors. So I looked up a cobalt blue and it says you need 100% cyan, 50%, 58% magenta, no yellow, and 33% black. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it by weight. I have this little teeny mini scale. I think it's called a pocket scale. I think they're about 15 bucks on Amazon. And I'm going to do it by weight. So I'm going to do 0.100 grams of C, 0.58 of M, and 0.33 of K. Or sorry, 1 gram, and then 0.58 of M, and 0.33 of black. So, what you need is some bottles to put it in after you're done making it, some pipettes to get your colors, your refills, your ink refills, a little teeny scale, some isopropyl alcohol. I use 99% but I'm sure you could get away with 70% and that would be fine too. And some little cups to mix it in. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to do my cyan which is blue. So I'm going to turn on my scale And I'm going to tear it with my little container on top of it. So I'm at zero. Now I'm going to take my blue and I'm going to put one gram of blue ink into that as per my recipe. Oh dear, my scale turned off. Okay. So one gram. So you may want to wear gloves for this because it could get a bit messy. I, I'm not really scared of mess. Okay, so I put a little bit more than one gram. I'll try to suck out a little bit. Okay, one gram of blue, or cyan. Now, the recipe calls for 0.58 of magenta. So I'll add, I'll tear that again, so that it goes back to zero, and I'm gonna add 0.58 grams of magenta. There we go. All right, now I need 0.33 of black. And this is supposed to mix up into cobalt blue. So, oops, drop my pipette. Tear again so you get back to zero. This black isn't even open yet. And 0.33 of black. Oops, this little scale doesn't stay on for very long. Okay, so 0.33. There we go. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my pipette and I'm going to suck it up just to mix it. And you can already see 
that it's a lovely shade of cobalt blue in my little dish. Now this doesn't seem like a lot of ink, but what I'm going to do now, I couldn't find a recipe for this, I'm kind of just winging it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour this into my bottle where I'm going to keep it in. And then Hang on, sorry, I need to focus while I'm pouring, apparently. I'm going to add some alcohol to it. Now, I couldn't find a recipe that said how much alcohol to add to it. So, I don't know. I'm just going to wing it. I'm going to add some. I'm just adding it in the cup so I can wash it out a bit. Okay, now give that a good mix. This is a really big bottle, but if, if it was in a smaller bottle, it would look like a lot more ink. Okay, so let's give this a test to see how it worked. So I was aiming for cobalt blue. I'll grab my uh, art journal and we'll see I'll spray it on a page and see how it reacts. Okay. So, let's see how it does. Okay, so it seems... I mean, it's definitely cobalt blue. It has similar properties to the alcohol ink that you buy. Maybe it's not quite as runny. Which, you know, it depends on how much, how much um, alcohol you add to it. Uh, this is very saturated, like super saturated. Uh, let's see what happens if we spray some alcohol on it. And see if we can get it to bleed. So it does bleed like the alcohol inks, but almost not, not as much. It soaked into the page a lot more, but then I didn't have any gesso on this page. So, yeah. I'm going to make up a few different colors like this. That one definitely worked out color-wise. It was a nice cobalt blue. Um, you be the judge of whether you think it worked well or not, and whether you want to make it. And if you give it a try, let me know what you think and how it worked out for you and uh, thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe thanks so much bye